What's good? We back. Marcy Sports Talk. We in the building. Make sure you check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All three links in the description. Make sure you smash the subscribe button. Hit the bell icon button, okay? Make sure you check out for my next video. My next video is going to be a very, very special video, man. Um, a story that I, I want to talk about. I want, it, I want you guys to share the next video. I want to promote this, especially around this time of the year. Um, and just for all my young brothers out there that's aspiring to bounce back from... Uh, you know, making mistakes early in life, man. So make sure you check out that next video. But um, I made a uh, post in one of the Piston groups on Facebook, man. I don't think nobody responded to it, though, because uh, I don't post in there a lot. So probably like, who the fuck is this dude, right? Um, Josh Jackson, man. I think the Pistons should go get Josh Jackson as well. I, I want them to get Markel Folks for the right price if it's shoulder check out. Now, um, Josh Jackson is not being utilized right in Phoenix. Now, last year... Um, before you guys go, you know, a lot of people are so gaudy on stats. Oh, he didn't do this. I don't get into analytics and stats that much, you know what I'm saying, as far as um, I like the eye test when it comes to basketball. And Josh Jackson can play. And last year when uh, they had some injuries, T.J. Warren, Booker, before Aiden got there. Aiden, sorry, too. I'm going to speak on him at the end of this video. But before they, they got some injuries, man, Josh Jackson was the guy. And he had the ball in his hand. He had amazing numbers last year. I didn't understand the hype out of Kansas coming. I know he's from the area. But I seen it last year. And I see him flash potential yesterday too. Yesterday he could have had way more better, uh, way better numbers. But Jamal Crawford was so ball dominant, and he, you know, at the end of the day, you know, he being wasted in Phoenix. That's a long story short. Uh, Josh Jackson is being wasted in Phoenix, man. Okay, you got guys that's trying to be the alpha male in there. You got Devin Booker, uh, who he said he basically saying this his team. DeAndre Aiden, a rookie, saying it's his team, and Josh Jackson just sitting there in the middle, like you know, with T.J. Warren and. And um, you know, Melton and uh and some of the other youngers they got uh, young guys they got, the kid from Villanova, I can never remember his name. You know, he's just sitting there looking like, man, you got Dragon Bender over there. Man, we need to go out there and get Josh Jackson, dog. Real talk, bring bring dude back home, man. You know, bring dude back home. Just straight up. We can use him. We need him at the three spot. He can play the two spot. He can score. He improving his shooting. He can rebound. And best of all, he can defend. What is he about six eight, six nine? A uh, swing guy, man, and he ain't gonna do nothing but get better. And that can take some of the ball responsibility away from Blake Griffin. He can he can handle the point. He'd be the perfect guy to play with, like Markel Fultz. That'd be a power move for the Pistons to do that, man. You get Markel Fultz if his shoulder check out. And like I said, I heard he injured his shoulder in a motorcycle accident actually. So that's a rumor that's going around. Let me say that. So we know how you know most people feel about motorcycles, especially after the old dude from Duke that went to Chicago Bull messed his career up with a, on a motorcycle. But that's nor here nor there. But, um, yeah, Jackson will be a great piece, man. I mean, you got two of the top five picks in the uh, draft last year. If you can swing Markel, folks, and you can swing Josh Jackson all day. You know what I'm saying? And, obviously, you don't have to get rid of Blake Griffin or Drummond in those scenarios. But, you know, I, you know, obviously, Phoenix are looking, is looking for, I don't know what they, what, what their direction of their team is. Okay? They got Ariza at the three. Josh Jackson playing the four, but he really played the three or the three. Um... You got the kid from uh, Villanova uh, that played a three. You know, um, Dragon Bender, he's not getting no burn. So, you know, you don't know where they're going. You know, their direction is. And if you can get it, you know, you can trade for Josh. I don't know what you have to give up. Obviously, I would try to say Luke Kennard, um, Stanley Johnson would probably be a package deal to them. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if they would want those guys. But, um, you know, you have to package them dudes, man, and try to get something, man. And if it just takes you a first-round draft pick for Markel Fultz, then you ante up on, on, on some other assets and to get Josh Jackson. I'm calling for Josh Jackson. That just makes too much sense. If you get folks of ja uh, Josh Jackson around, Blake Griffin and Drummond, that, that's perfect, man. The Pistons, you know, if you get Dre to play some defense, Josh play some defense, Markel Fultz, when he healthy, is an amazing scorer. I like that. This is my personal opinion. I might be living in La La Land. But but let me say this, man. DeAndre Aiden is sorry, bro. Luke, Luka Donatich is the best rookie, and I said that coming out the draft. Um, not to toot my own horn. And the reason I knew Luca wasn't a regular uh European guy, this dude was it was 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 the MVP. You know, he wasn't sitting on the end of the end of the bench like Darko or playing like five, ten, fifteen minutes a game like Darko. This dude was the MVP of the one of them Euro leagues over there. And I watched his highlight, dude the real deal, man. They made a mistake on drafting DeAndre Ayton, dude. Dude ain't that good, man. I ain't gonna say he's gonna be a bust, he's gonna be formidable, but I think Luca Donatich is gonna be way better than him in my personal opinion. But, yeah, man, bring Josh Jackson back to the D, you feel me? Um, Motor City Sports Talk, let me know what y'all think. 
about the video. Uh, make sure to subscribe button, bell icon button. We'll make a donation to the channel. That link's in the description. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Also, reach out to me in the email. Hit me up on Twitter or the email for a video request. And I'll be on, uh, be on the lookout for my next video, man. It's going to be a real, real good, important video, a great story. I want people to uh, share the video, the next video and get the word out about uh, about the guy I'm about to talk about, man. Real prominent dude around the city. Um, you know, made some mistakes, slipped up, and uh, we kind of got reasons why he slipped up, what was going on. But good fellas, I mean, Motor City Sports Talk.